So basically using a strain gauge, we can go and measure weight. This can be very useful with our projects that require precision weight measurements. This is called a strain gauge. If we take a closer look at this component, we can see two connection pads and then we have a conductive wire pattern with repetitive deflections. This conductive wire has a defined resistance. As you can see, if I measure the resistance between the pads, we get around 300... And a part of that error is caused by the simple mechanics of the printer. The main reason for the lack of precision lies in the physics behind Plasma Arc to simple setup. I certainly haven't made a breakthrough in printing technology with this Plasma printer, but it is for sure another interesting device for teaching basic knowledge. All information about the Plasma printer as well as the build instructions are available on my pages. That is the current state of my printer development. As next steps I will design a mechanism for printing on paper rolls and try further options for the print head. In a previous video I had already shown a print head based on a relay. I would like to improve speed and resolution of this system because it is a very robust mechanism and a wide range of inks can be used. In future videos I will show the progress of this project named World Printer. According to the name, the world is printed here as a Rorschach test. Hello, how do you hear me? I think it's good, but you can probably hear some noise. <laughs> 